Okay. We got stranded in the war in the last episode, so... Oh, well, by the end of it, at least. And now the only thing around here that has any power are the cars. Crap. Can't do anything about her. Uh... Hmm. It's been an interesting morning, I will say that much. I'm glad to be playing more of this game. That explains why they're all wearing trash bags. I suspect that they're led by an extremely powerful conduit, so it'd be a big mistake to underestimate them. I get it. You know, that description is actually very similar to a Batman 90s story called Batman the Cult. And I will explain that story as soon as I see what this new power is going to be. Finally! I get that the thrusters back again. Gonna make getting around a hell of a lot easier. Oh hell yes. So in Batman the Cult, there was this <clears throat> preach preacher named Deacon Blackfire. And he was appealing to all the homeless people in Gotham City. And his whole thing was that I want the homeless people of Gotham to rise up and defend themselves from being, you know, scrutinized in the streets. I want them to take over, and it got insane. Like, Batman was jumped by his homeless people, fed this weird soup or concoction. They basically drugged the crap out of them. Oh, bad move, you guys. This is bad. There we go. Really? Somebody in the water is still alive. No. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. I don't even want to pop my head out right now. Okay, there we go. Didn't even give him the chance. It's got a good amount of hover. Especially just from a standard jump. Yeah, I'm going to be using this all the time now. Oh, there he is. Getting in the water. I don't know why they think that hiding in the water from a guy with electricity powers is going to do them any favors. Or is it lightning? Alright, everything's a lightning theme. So it is lightning. Oh my god! I hate those things so much! At least you can grab the ladder this frickin' time. I don't know why I'm having such a hard time getting on those things. Oh, okay. I was wondering where do I go next. Okay, I see it. 
thankfully that the developers thought of like oh when you're flying you'll see Cole like move his arm slightly to let you know he's gonna grab onto a ledge or something just a way of making sure that you know that you're landing on where you intend to land on okay but yeah in Batman the Cult Batman is basically drugged by a homeless man and a by a deacon and a bunch of his homeless followers and he is basically it, it's a legitimate cult batman joins the cult and they end up making them in like a, a brainless <laughs> they said you turn batman into a zombie for a little bit and this is one of those few batman stories that's extremely dark and takes place during a time where jason todd was still robin and like it gets so bad that Jason has to go to the, go to Gotham by himself, finding Batman. It's a really dark story, but it really culminates in the fact that the homeless people get so powerful that the National Guard has to get called in, and they're coming organized. And they literally there's a scene where a news broadcaster is talking about what's going on, and a homeless man just walks into the studio while this guy's on live TV and shoots him in the back of the head. Gotham is considered a disaster zone just because these homeless people, because it's not only all the homeless people in Gotham, but because Deacon Blackfire was so persuasive, homeless people from all the cities nearby were also joining his cause. So it was like a whole city of homeless. Dwight, didn't that guy steal your car and strip it down for parts? Yeah, he was a real tool, but, you know, I've dug his sister for a real long time now, and, uh, uh you'd be doing me a real solid with this. And you think if I find Dwight, she'll reward you? Well, hell, it's not like I can do anything from here. She says Dwight was hanging around the chummy chicken the last time they talked. I guess he was working over there. That might be a good place for you to start. Okay. Stupid. Hi, Trish. Oh. It's getting bad over here. People are dying and there's nothing I can do. I need to get a bus over to Bayview and see if it still has any supplies. I came through the tunnel and it's trashed. Same with the Stone Canal drawbridge. You remember Roger Miller from Amy's graduation? He's a city engineer that used to work with my dad. And if anyone can fix the bridge, it'd be him. He lives by Valentine Park. I'll try and find him. Okay, oh, I got two missions to choose from. An old friend or Zeke's request. I think I'll do the old friend one just because it's closer. Oh, actually, hold on. I can see it there in the distance, but... One, I want to take out this homeless guy. Two, I need more electricity. Actually, look at my powers. See if I can upgrade anything. Oh, I got a lot of skill points. Uh, I could do the shockwave. Okay, my PS3 has been doing a weird thing where if I'm pressing the arrow keys or sometimes R1 or L1, it'll make that sound. I don't know if you guys can hear it in the recording, but yeah, that, that right there. It's really weird. Like it does it every few times I'm hitting the um, arrows. Okay, increases blast radius. Uh, thunder drop. I already got all those. I could do it in the melee. I like using it sometimes. I might could recharge while on rails or wires. Uh, that could be useful. Okay. Uh, let's do shock grenades just because I use those a lot. And might as well do the trap wave. Okay. That should help. I hope. Hey, it's just like home. I'm just getting shot at from every direction. Good to see nothing's really changed. This doesn't look good. Trish, I think I found Roger. He must have done something to piss these guys off because they're all over him. 
There's a rumor going around that the transients are kidnapping engineers and mechanics. Oh, the transients, that's her name, I think. The worst part is that they publicly execute anyone who refuses to work. If they've got Roger, you have to take them all out at the same time, or they'll kill him. Don't worry, I'll handle it. They say that, but they don't give me any cool, like, good place to recharge. I thought there was going to be, like, a sniping mission. How did I manage to shoot that despite not having a clear shot of his head? Guessing where his head would be. You're that guy, aren't you? The one with the powers. Yeah. Listen, are you Roger Miller? Trish Daly sent me. She's hoping you can fix the Stone Canal drawbridge. Trish? She's stuck in the quarantine, too. Afraid so. Hell, used to go camping with them, you know? Kind of fell out of touch when her old man got transferred upstate. What about Amy? Did she make it out? Uh, yeah, she did. Good. Good. I hate to see both those girls stuck in here. I was listening to their conversation. Yeah, we gotta get going. Oh, come on. That's why I've been shooting them. Like, this guy's just gonna keep shooting them until I get rid of them. There we go. Alright, come on. Almost there. There we go. Oh man. But you know what? I haven't brought this up before. Cause there are only, there are a couple of times I've seen so far where they actually zoom in on Cole's backpack. But you look at his backpack, there's actually a Sly Cooper's logo at the bottom of it. Not the bottom, but like Near the center of it, where the strap, where the, um, yeah, the center of the bag. I think that I'll say that. It's cool, man. I like those little references to their past series. Okay. Oh, I see now. from Sunday. Watch my back. This is going to take a while. Great. They were not kidding. They were not kidding. Man, these guys are strong as crap. Guess they don't want the bridge open. Damn, circuits are fried. Damn it. I can't tell if the explosion killed them or if I killed them, but crap. If only I have more stuff to recharge from. Of course, I gotta start from back there again. Shit.
It's crazy there's only two people. Well, I'm sure the other guy's probably holding up a minigun. Yup. Here we go. Jesus. Guess they don't want the bridge open. Damn, circuits are fried. Kill them! All of them! Wait, what? Really? One of them exploding my face actually kills me. All right, no more fucking around. They don't want the bridge over. Yeah, I was not fucking around anymore. Damn, circuits are fried. Kill them! All of them! You about done over there? Working as fast as I can. There we go. There we go. Thank God. Oh, sometimes I just need to cut the bullshit and be like serious to get some of the stuff done. Hydraulics on the other side aren't engaging. Well, can you fix them? No. Has to be done on the far side of the bridge. Hey, hold on. I know someone who might be able to help us. Lou? It's Roger. It, the number four hydraulic on the south side of SC isn't engaging, and I need your help getting it online. Where are you? Memorial Park, near the bridge. But unless you're carrying a gun, I'm not going anywhere. Reapers are swarming all over this place. Yeah, well, uh, I'm sending something that's better than a gun. See you in a bit. Yep, I already saw the blue arrow. That's why I headed across the bridge automatically. Oh, great, we're back in Reaper territory. Yay, I'm home again. Unfortunately. Damn. I like to think that that sound meant that I sent his whole body through a plate glass window. I don't know why I'm not traveling by rooftop now. I can technically just hover everywhere. Apparently, moving my feet is somehow more appealing. Going to have to hit those guys fast. Yeah, I probably shouldn't waste shots like that, but it worked out. You all right? Holy crap, that was insane. Did Roger send you? Yeah, let's go. So what did the Reapers want with you? They heard the transients are looking for engineers to work on their tower, so they were going to trade me. Figured they'd get a reward or something. Seems like a lot of work to build a monument to garbage. All I know is that working on that thing is a death sentence. They work you until you drop, and then they pop you in the head. Damn, it's pretty fucked up. I do like how, very much like, as I brought up before, this particular section of the city is like Batman the cult, and but the whole game is kind of like Batman No Man's Land, where after a bunch of earthquake decimated Gotham City, the U.S. government was like, you know what, we're going to lock off all of Gotham and we're going to consider it a disaster zone. We're going to be, we're going to be dropping off food and supplies to like 
great drops, but otherwise the city is on its own. Oh my god, did that train just run over some reapers? They stopped shooting the second it came by, and like a bunch of red dots just suddenly disappeared. There we go. They just popped up on top of that train track out of nowhere. I was really hoping to check out at least one Reaper with all these explosions, but apparently that wasn't so. There we go. It's safe now. Get that thing fixed. Anyone else? Hey, need some help over here. Uh, Tell Roger I'm on my way. I gotta jump between the bridges now, between the different halves of the city. Oh, great. Yeah, aiming, shooting, and gliding is very awkward. are going to cause me any more problems. Better go check on Lou. Okay, so their names really are just the transients. That's a fair enough game for a group about homeless people. Seriously. How are you guys so fucking organized? a little bit more power. Hey, look at that. Shock rate actually went off just fine. to fire the hydraulics stand back look I'd love to stay in chat but I gotta find someplace safe see you around all right oh thankfully I'll be able to soon just use the bridge to get across even from the tallest building here, it's going to be a trek trying to glide from one side of the city to the other without the bridge. And to think, if I'd taken early retirement, I would have missed all this. Well, I need to have my head examined. Thanks for helping with the bridge. And no sweat. Tell Trish I said hello. Hi, you've reached Trish Daly's voicemail. Please leave a message. Trish, I just want to let you know that the drawbridge is down. I'll give you a call later and see how things are going. There we go. I just want to grab that battery. Okay, guys, but uh, I think that's going to be the end of this part. I'll cover that next mission next time, but thank you guys for watching. I appreciate everything you guys do, and I appreciate the simple fact that you guys like to watch my videos. But, as always, stay safe out there, and I will see you guys later.